Hey YouTube, this is Tutorials on Game Solid, and this is my first video. In this series, I am going to cover from the basics of Game Solid to advanced Game Solid. In this video, we're going to be learning the base, some of the basics of Game Solid. So first, you're going to want to get Game Solid. If you don't already have it, go to GameSolid.com. I'll put the link in the description, and you can just say Download Creator for free. You can get it from Mac or Windows. Then you want to open up Game Salad. If you just got it, you won't see all these here, so don't worry. You're going to press blank project, double click it, and we're going to do a labyrinth game. So we're going to name it Labyrinth Pro. You can keep it on iPhone landscape, that means holding it sideways. You can just leave those as it is. So then we're going to go want to go to the scenes tab. And we're going to we're going to go into it should be already there. It will be already there. So we're going to press this plus now to make a new actor. An actor is like a character in your game. So we're going to name it Ball. Since we're not going to get to images or anything today, we're just going to do something with the ball. I know that sounds weird. So we're going to do, we're going to make, we're going to do some code with the ball. So first, so you don't forget, drag the ball onto the scene. Sorry, let me make this bigger for you. Drag the ball onto the scene so when you code it and you just press the preview button, so what will happen when you press when you want to see the game, it will already be there and you won't have to drag it on again. So we're gonna press create rule in the top right corner. We're gonna do actor receives event. Touch is pressed. Then we're gonna do display text. Text is hello everyone. Red and the font is going to be Futura, and you can leave that. If you want to do wrap inside actor, that means the text will only be inside of the actor, will only be on the white. But no, that's not what I want. So then we're gonna cop. We're gonna copy and paste that command C and command V. We're going to do touch is released, so it will always be there. It will, the text will always be there. If you don't want it to always be there, you can just turn this rule off. So then we can press the preview button. You're just going to see this ball right here. Well, this square right here. So we're going to press the, we're going to press it, and it's going to say hello everyone. If we don't want that, if we don't want that to happen, we just turn this rule off, and you can press it, and only when you're pressing it that text will stay there. So that's all I'm going to cover today since I don't want to get the videos too long. So thank you for watching and new videos coming out every Friday. See you later.